had two dogs. I'm getting good at thinking of you. I'm doing well and crying too. Could be the best at being blue. I'm getting good at missing you. Take us home, boy. I'll build with the silver hammer and the golden nail. With the silver hammer, I make the heavens sing. And the golden nail, I make the rap. How many of y'all go to church out there? That's a lot of folks. We got something that we want to present to you here this evening. You know, a lot of... Let me have my banjo here, Jeff. Yeah, that. Right here. Daddy, get his banjo. Uh, we got a, a brand new chorus that we want to introduce to you. You know, when you go in there to church, it seems like a lot of things uh, have changed a little bit as far as the song service. You know, the hymn service is kind of a thing of the past, and they got the, the new stuff. Well, we got a, a new chorus we'd like to introduce to you. If you like this song that we're fixing to do, of course, it's on our new CD. And we want to invite you to come up after we get done with our show. Pick up a copy of these words right here. It's entitled Rivers of Life. Take it to your church. Maybe you folks start singing it there. But we hope you all enjoy it. A personal friend of ours wrote this. He's a songwriter. And Dad sings it. It's entitled Rivers of Life. Let me get my banjo here. <laughs> I love this chorus right here. We're going to be in Moultrie tomorrow night. Moultrie. Full gospel church over there. 
Uh, in fact, uh, the pastor and his wife were here. They love the bluegrass. You talk about a live church full of string instruments, keyboards. We've been there several times and have had a wonderful time every time. It'll start what time? Six o'clock. Six o'clock. Harvey, and you and that little lady and others uh, know where it's at. Is it on the, the highway one, 122 going east? 122. Out of Motry. Is that right? 122. Huh? 133, Highway 133. Is it 133? Sorry about that. Did... Okay. But anyhow, but I tell you, if you come, you better come early because uh, if it's like it always has been, it's going to fill up. But I understand they're enlarging the building. So let's try this one on them tonight. I just want to tell and remind them: go up there and get this song, take it to your church, and maybe uh, y'all can start singing it. But it's real easy. It's called Rivers of Life. And uh, go something like this. hand this evening. Uh, now, of course, you all know my uncle, he doesn't get to go with us very much. And th actually, this is the first trip he's gotten to go with us out, out like this. But he's from Denver, Colorado. Uh, tomorrow night after the service is over, we're going to take him back to Birmingham, put him back on his old Southwest Airlines, put him back on the plane. Now! From Denver! Are you ready to rumble? Audie Baldridge! <laughs> oh, 
Well, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Before you get started, we're going to bring a special woman up here. Her name is Taunts. We want to sing to this woman. Uncle Lottie is going to sing to you, Taunts. Y'all, she just had her shoulder operated on. She was uh, involved in some bulldogging at a rodeo. Can't keep her down. But Uncle Lottie's going to sing her some love songs. And then I'm going to sing her some love songs. Oh. May the best big bull win, buddy. Get in the key of A then. If I'm going to sing a love song to this woman. Yeah. Look at her. <laughs> Y'all give her a hand. Cheer her on up here. Oh! You know, the why, you know the reason why he's getting her up here? He wants to sing to her himself. And she has already promised him if he would sing her a love song, she would give him a Martin guitar. Yeah. He had to bait her to get her up here. Scoot over. <laughs> sit Did down, I get to sit down? down? Get on the DVD. Don't she look pretty? She looks good. Woo! Wow. I won't keep your hands off that guitar, boy. I'm going to do a key of A. Where's the chopper at? He had to go to the bathroom. Oh, man alive. That boy He's always been having problems somewhere. here lately. Um, before I attempt to sing... I just wanted to say that I have never been treated so well as I have since I've been to Georgia. You guys have been just absolutely super. And uh, I've appreciated being able to come down and, and do what little bit I could for, uh, uh, for you as far as the sings. I think we should try uh, to keep him, don't y'all? Well, now, some of you said yeah, some of you didn't say anything. I want this lady here, since uh, I'm supposed to be singing a love song to her. <coughs> Let's see who See, I wins. am the fireman. <laughs> <laughs> well, they call me the fireman, and that's my name. Making my rounds all over town and putting out old flames. Well, everybody'd like to have what I got. I can cool them down when it's smoldering hot. I'm the fireman. That's my name. Last night they had a bad one a mile or two down the road. Well, my buddy walked out and left his woman burning out of control. Well, I was down there about an hour or so with a little mouth of mouth. She was ready to go. I'm the fireman, and that's my name. Call me the fireman, that's my name. Making my rounds all over town, to putting out old flame. Well, everybody'd like to have a water I got. I can cool them down when it's smoldering hot. I'm the fireman. That's my name, burn them up. So far, she's not impressed. Got a fire engine red T-Bird automobile And a minute or less I can be dressed fit to kill I work 24 on and 24 off When they get too hot to just give me a call Cause I'm the fireman 
That's my name. Come in the fireman. That's my name. Making my rounds all over town, a putting out old flame. Well, everybody'd like to have what I got. I can cool them down when it's smoldering hot. I'm the fireman, and that's my name. He's a fireman, but <laughs> buddy, I've thrown a lot of coal in the fire myself. <laughs> <laughs> come on up here, Charlie. Charlie, come on up here. You had your game plan. It didn't go too far. Now it's time to step it up a notch during this game. He's come on, young. Charlie. Don't He's take young, so young, long, buddy. Where you at? Y'all give Charlie a hand right here. Oh, look at him. Uh-oh. Well, it's going to do a lot, but oh, the Dad sound must... man's thinking we're going to steal something. He got it all tied up here. <laughs> Dad must be having really problems here. Put her in the key of E, Paul. His movements are regular now key for some reason. E, Charlie. E. Get up, Taunts, for me, will you, honey? He wants to sit down. <laughs> sit down. Oh, look at him. Look at him. <laughs> Zoom in. There was a man I met. I told you about him today. He says, Sean, when there's another bull in your pasture... <laughs> Go an extra step. <laughs> that man's name was Conway Twitty. <laughs> Give me the key of E. There's a lot of ways of saying what I want to say to you. There's songs and poems and promises and dreams that might come true. But I won't talk of starry skies, the moonlight on the ground. I'll come right out and tell you, I just love to lay you down. Lay you down and softly whisper pretty love words in your ear. Lay you down and tell you all the things a woman loves to hear. I'll let you know how much it means just having you around. Oh, darling, how I'd love to lay you down. There's so many ways your sweet love's made this house into a home. You've got a way of doing little things that turn me on. Like standing in the kitchen in your faded cotton gown. With your hair all up in curlers, I still love to lay you down. Play boy. Buddy Conway had a lot of fun in his life. There's a whole lot of de 
December showing in your face. Your auburn hair is faded and silver takes its place. You'll be just as lovely. I'll still be around. If I can, I know that I still love to lay you down. Lay you down and softly Woo! whisper pretty love words in your ear. Lay you down and tell you all the things my woman loves to hear. I'll let you know how much it means just having you around. Oh, darling, how I'd love to lay you down. Bathrooms that around here. Could somebody go and man, he must re... stomach must be really bothering him. Hey, you see who she's standing with? Unc, ever you just you, you you just wait until I sing this one to her. Uh oh, come on up here, Han. Let's get it in about the key of A. The key of A. A. Do you want her to stand or do you want her to sit? Right over there. Where's Joe at? (laughs) (laughs) Go ahead and start the song. Go ahead. I love. I love you, I'll prove it in days to come. I love you, darling, you're the only one. I'll swear it's true, there'll be no other blue day. I love you, I'll prove it a thousand ways. You're my darling, you've been true. I should have been good to you. You're the one that's in my heart. We're apart. Oh, darling, please wait. Please wait until I'm free. Be a change, a great change made in me. I'll swear it's true. There'll be no other blue day. I love you, I'll prove it a thousand ways. a brother for you. I love you. I'll prove it in days to come. I love you, darling. You're the only one. I'll swear it's true. There'll be no other blue day. I love you. I'll prove it a thousand ways. You're my darling, you've been true. I should have been good to you. You're the one that's in my heart while we're apart. So darling, please wait, please wait until I'm free. There'll be a change, a great change made in me. I'll swear it's true, I'll prove it to you someday. I love you, I'll prove it a thousand ways. Thank you. 
Thank you, folks. Well, it looks like we both lost to my little brother. <laughs> Tell him get out of the way. Get out Something else. I got a question for this little lady right here. Come here, hon. Her name's Tom. You little sweet thing. Stop that. Tonks. That's her name. Tonks. Tonks. Uh, you, you fine, honey. Come here. She's got one word for you and just a quick question. Our show's about over. You've been keeping up on the national and international news. Okay, son. This is an easy question. <laughs> if Russia happens to attack Turkey from the rear, do you think Greece will help? <laughs> Yeah, you. Come here, honey. Just got one quick question. We'll move on. It's about over. You want? I'll ask you from here. <laughs> you got any idea how you cook toilet paper? Brown it. Throw it in a pot. <laughs> you ever been back in Missouri in the hills of the Ozarks? Oh, there's some marvelous things back there. You ever come to my big ranch, I want you to come by and visit with me. I'm one of the bigger mule trainers, and I got the biggest ranch probably in all of Missouri. Got talking snakes. S talking snakes? Oh, yeah, buddy. They're already out? Mm-hmm. When you come into this great big ranch of mine, you, you got to stop on a bridge because <clears throat> I got a river that runs down the middle of it, about the size of the Mississippi. I stopped the other morning at 6 o'clock. 6 o'clock in the morning? I heard a conversation going on between two baby snakes and their mama. Oh, get out of here. Talking Oh, snakes. yeah, it's coming out in the inquiry. I don't believe it. Must be true. I overheard the mama snake say, Hey! If you're going to hiss, get up out of your mama's pit and go down to Mrs. Potts' pit and hiss. <laughs> you. Yeah. Come here, honey. Uh, take that microphone stand off of this cord. I had a longer cord than this when I was born. Are you a good listener? Come here. Can you tell everybody? I want you on the video. Tell everybody what your name is. My name is Josette Spryout. And where's your home? Glenville, Georgia. Now, I want you to listen real close. Turn around where everybody can see you, honey. I want you to listen real close. Are you a good listener? Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes. <clears throat> Mama Snake said to her baby snakes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll try another one. Hey, that's pretty complicated. If you're going to hiss, get up out of your mama's pit and go down to Mrs. Potts' pit and hiss. Can I, can I tell you in French? <laughs> she wants to tell me in French. <laughs> Are you? She's French. You better get an American. Better get an American. Sit down. 
She's liable to miss. <laughs> hey, nobody would ever know it. Mama Snake. Give her a nice round of applause. She says she just can't do it. <laughs> mama Snake said, hey, if you're going to hiss, get up out of your mama's pit and go down to Mrs. Pot's pit and hiss. I followed them down the river. <laughs> I lost them till I heard them hissing in Mrs. Pot's pit. Mrs. Pot's come along, heard them hissing in her pit, said, hey! If you're going to hiss, get up out of Mrs. Potts' pit and you go back to your mama's pit and hiss. <laughs> that was close, boys. <laughs> they finally got back to their mama's pit to hiss. <laughs> Mama Snake come along, heard them hissing in her pit, said, Hey, what's going on down there at Mrs. Potts' pit? Baby Snake said, Mrs. Potts was complaining because we was hissing in her pit. <laughs> Mama Snake said, don't worry about Mrs. Potts. I remember when she didn't have a pit to hiss in. <laughs> oh, you're a wonderful audience. We'll see you later. That's all of it. Is that it? There ain't no last song. They're playing on the boss man's time. Hold it down. Play. All that love stuff up here. Taunts, I'm telling you what's the truth, honey. I bet you're dripping, honey. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's what we're fixing to do there. Well, just, All right. the way just it sing works, it. We hope you guys have enjoyed the Gold Wing Express. Here's a song that we always close our show out with. It's entitled, I'm Gonna Live Forever. May God bless all of you and uh, hope to see you out there again sometime soon. Go ahead, Paul. safely to the light when this old world is blown asunder and all the stars fall from the sky remember jesus really loves you we'll live forever you and i our mother was 53 years old when she passed away almost nine years ago. Three weekends ago, our grandmother passed away. Our grandma was actually our mother's mom. Both of those ladies were full Blood Creek Indian. During the funeral, we had seen a lot of family and friends that we hadn't seen in many, many years. There was a lot of Indian people there. The Indian folks have a real special tradition that they do at the funerals if you've never been to one it is something else to see mom was 53 our grandmother was almost 84 years old friends towards the end my grandma she said 
My legs hurt. My arms hurt. My body's tired. But today, she's got a brand new pair of legs. She's got a brand new pair of arms. She's got a brand new body. There at the end of our mother's, when she passed away, she said she was tired. Today she feels refreshed. She doesn't have to take that old morphine stuff. She's got a brand new body as well. And that's where I want to see them. And that's where I want to join them someday. But while we're here on this old earth, with everything that's going on in this old world here today, anytime you turn on the news, it's always bad news. But I still firmly believe inside of my heart, still yet today, that the United States of America, it is still without a doubt the best place on earth to live. Woo! I'm gonna live forever. I'm gonna cross that river. I'm gonna live eternal now. If my dad is back there in the back, and if my uncle is back there, I'd like for both of those guys to come down here in the front. Our dad, he served in the Army. Our uncle, he served in the United States Navy. If we could get whoever, if you served in the United States Army, the Air Force, the Marine Corps, the Navy, if you would, please join them right down here in the front. And as they come, let's all give them what they deserve, and that's a nice round of applause. As they come, as I call the name of your branch, would you please raise your hand? The United States Army. The United States Navy. The United States Air Force. The United States Marine Corps. The United States Merchant Marines. The National Guard. United States Coast Guard. Last but not least, all the men and women still today away from their homes, protecting this country, keeping us safe from all harm. Let's give them one nice round of applause. God bless you and God bless America. Please turn around here and look at the flag. God bless America. Help us sing. Land that I love. Stand beside her and guide her through the nights with the lights from above. From the mountain to the prairie, from the ocean, white with fall. We love you, folks. God bless you. Did you enjoy Gold Wing Express? Wow. Gracious. That absolutely looked marvelous. It was, uh, it was definitely worth the encore, I'm telling you. That was good. Uh, at 10.30... You guys get your watch out at 1030 or shortly after Whitney gets done, we'll start passing the DVDs out.
the new boss man. You can go right through there. Final.